Hey everybody, it's Chugga Conroy. Welcome back to more Pokemon Black and White. Last time, we went over the Sea Gear and all of its remaining little odds and ends and entered the Intro Link. See what I did there? And we saw everything that I had to offer upgrading our trainer card once more. This time, I have a clash of ages lined up for you. Thankfully not in the form of the movie that is called that. We have something a little bit special that I want to do here today. Before we get started, I just want to let you know up front that this is a video focused entirely on an aspect of multiplayer, will not feature any single player progress at all, and is just a fun little extra that I wanted to do. I would like to introduce somebody who has been very instrumental to this, the creation of this series. Somebody who... Well, not the somebody though, but the person who is behind the creation of the portraits of the legendary encounters, and the person who was the player behind Whitlia 90% of the time. They would play the game for me in between segments when I could not, and they were also responsible for coming up with, I think, four of the 16 members that Whitlia used. In general, they're a creative genius. Introduce yourself. That's very flattering. <laughs> Why, thank you very much. I wasn't expecting to be, like, complimented with, a, like, an iron fist. Now I've made things awkward. Hooray! You do that very well. But hello, I am a Sayanella. I, he, 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 he threatened me to, to, to do all of this, all of this work on black and white. Wow, I compliment <laughs> you back, and now you're just like, you're abusive to me. Everyone gang up on him. I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. It was my pleasure to work on, work on black and white, and it was an honor to work on the portraits as much as I have. It was, it was really fun. It was actually really neat to be able to experience the game all over again and have your series going on at the same time as playing Whitlia and being able to be like, wow, I didn't know I could do all this stuff, you know? You yeah. taught me so many things when this was the first Pokemon game that I really finished myself. Mm -hmm. So, like, it, it was really fun. I enjoyed it. Oh, well, thank, th thank you. That is the best compliment I think Let's Players can ever receive. But so. you overworked me! I was about to say, you say all that, but <laughs> you had to listen to me stammer on about Pokemon for, like, 80 hours of video, <laughs> and you had to draw pictures on harsh deadlines and everything, so... And I had to keep up in my own game. <laughs> <laughs> and I had to work on Majora's Mask. <laughs> well, and I had to... No, I'm kidding. Please. Well, I was about to say, and, well, well... You were just working that hard that your head spun around it. Anyway, um, Hi. I would like to meet you in the union room, please. All right, I am a preschooler no more. I forget what I said it to, but I was playing. No! What are you? You look like a pirate. I don't know what sprite that is based on that description, but that's kind of funny. You you have like a headband and a Pokeball on it. And Team Aqua? It's a red headband. Oh, I'm a Pokemon breeder! Oh! <laughs> I look like a pirate. No, he really looks like a pirate. I think he's carrying, like, a rake. Is that his weapon? N what? No. I mean, he has overalls. You have green overalls. You have, like, you, you have, like, a farmer's tan in the making. And you have a headband. You're an overalled pirate. That breeds I'm a redneck pirate, basically. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so um, what I wanted to say is that we are here to have a battle today. I thought it would be fun, and so did you, and so did a lot of the audience, actually. I felt a little bit unoriginal in the fact that they had the same idea, but I guess <laughs> we're on the same page here. I thought it would be, f we all thought it would be fun that the last time Blair and Whitley would interact, they would fight to see who constructed the better team. I think we all know the answer to this question. Uh, well, we let's see. We all know the answer to this question. Now, they have to be single. Um, we're doing single battles. And to set all of the levels to be the same so that levels don't matter because I'm quite a bit higher level than you, we are forced to do a three-on-three -three battle. Is your Zebstrika going to sit out? Are you leaving her out? You should leave her out. You're just manipulating me, aren't I'm you? I'm not manipulating you. <laughs> you don't know who I'm going to use. Oh, is it going to be guessing? Oh, shoot. Well, you'll know after I select them because you'll see the three on team preview once the fight starts. Sorry I made you wait. Let's get started. Hey, it's you. It's me. And I'm not a redneck pirate anymore. 
<laughs> so you can see my six, you can see yours. Oh, your team members aren't all level 50 because you weren't all the way up. Whoop! <laughs> you have to be at least 50 to get that. <laughs> Whoop! Do you want to go through with it anyway? Why the heck not? Okay, okay, okay. I I'm, I'm close enough, right? Close enough, I suppose. Kind of. The original plan was the way that I usually do things in that we speed the battle up and do post commentary so we can talk strategy, but I decided this time to not do that because I think our live commentary was pretty good. Jaya! She's open up with Superior, level 50, uh, overgrow for its ability, grass type, with the Excuse moves, me, coil. why are you giving me a bio? <laughs> Stop predicting me! <laughs> I am Rock! Always have been, always will be. I understand that reference now. Oh, also, yes, you do. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't at first when you first started the series, but uh, I would like to set the record straight that Jaya is named after the Irian Jaya carpet snake. Uh huh. The carpet python. I saw like a lot of people trying to guess what Jaya was named after, and no one picked up that it was like a type of snake. It's like the kind of snake that I really want. It's really pretty. Hmm. It's really, really pretty. Well, I'll keep that in mind whenever I want to give you an awkward gift, I guess. Whoa! Don't give me a no, snake! No, no, no. <laughs> Leap. Oh, you're faster than me! <laughs> How are you faster than me? <laughs> okay, oh, no! I, I'm not a defeatist! I'm not a defeatist! Huh, rip. Rip, yes! rip, 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 rip. Oh my gosh. I am. Wow. I, I think I'm not in defeatist by one HP. Oh. I'm mad. I'm really upset by that. I think I am not in defeatist by one HP. Okay, wait a second, wait a second. What level Dude, is Jaya? No, it's by Jaya's half of an HP. HP because it's rounded down for defeatist and I am in the rounded up HP. <sighs> I am not in defeatist by one half of a hit. Emil, point. we're not even playing Mario Party. <laughs> Please, tone down that luck. Oh my gosh, I'm sorry. You're not sorry. You never accept my apologies! You're not sorry! But you never believe I am when I really am. Sucker punch. Okay, that's that was a good move. Rock slide! Ooh, in Defeatist, I can't quite knock you out. <laughs> oh, gee. You don't say. Now I'm curious who you have last. It bad. <laughs> it bad? It bad. Did you wanna, oh. Just bad. <laughs> I thought you selected Bear Tick because you wanted to beat me with Bear Tick. I thought about it, but I looked at the team matchups and I was just like, Bear Tick's not gonna be able to do anything. Well, I'm in defeatist right now. But honestly. This bad. Rather than sack rock, I think I want to see how well it can do. Scrafty's got a lot of defense. So it was able to survive one. Retaliate. Oh. Are you serious? <laughs> it wasn't type effective. I don't care if it wasn't type effective. You had less than half. And that has like how much attack? That has so much freaking attack. I'm pissed. I'm sorry. You're not sorry. <laughs> <laughs> your your sorry has a gigantic smile on your face. I'm so pissed at how that went. Now I'm so angry at how that went. I wanted to wait till the you end got a critical hit, by the way. <laughs> so I wasn't in defeatist for the last hit, effectively. <laughs> okay. I wanted to bring up the idea of this after the fight because we can only do three on three. Do you want to do a rematch with the misfits who didn't get to fight so everyone gets a chance? <laughs> oh, so you mean all the garbage that I left behind? I mean, no, I'm sorry, I team. mean, you, I actually garbage. left garbage behind, so. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait, that's really funny. Wait, that's, that's actually really funny. Okay, I, I thought about this a lot, and I know who I would use. Um, you know what I'm going to use, it's just a matter of what order. Oh, boy. Oh, wait! Uh, I, I probably would have done something differently. Oops. Sorry. I just, I already hit confirm before you said anything. No, it's fine. Wit Leah would like to battle. 
Which Leah sent out Merk. Merk, Merk. Precisely what I was hoping you would do. Okay, intimidate. Question is, what TMs do you actually have on that thing? I don't know offhand what Burke has at this point. I, I can guess based on what it learns. But even though I've played with this team, I don't know exactly what it had in the end because you played the final boss fight, at least up to it. Oh! Ha 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 ha! Well, that's bad. All right, how much is this gonna do, I wonder? Because you get same type attack bonus and that hits for a lot, ooh. Okay. You're fat. We're in a speed tie? Oh my god. We're speed tied. Look at us. I was hoping it would miss again. Yeah, I felt it too. Okay, I win the speed tie. It's alternating now. Oh, critical! Are you for real? I didn't... Wow, shoot. Are you serious right now? Honu. Aqua Jet, Let's see how that does. I'm at least happy you take Rocky Helmet damage from that. Oh! I quit! <laughs> I quit everything! I'm sorry. You're not sorry! <laughs> Also, I'd like to mention that I'm level 45! That's a whole lot of sorry you got on your face, Emil. A whole lot of sorry. I'm sorry, I can't help but smile, then. Okay. Yeah, because of course. Mm -hmm. Crunch, okay. This is so sad. You're in charge, smiley face. I do want to state, again, I had an unfair advantage. That wasn't cool. I thought setting levels meant setting levels. Because <laughs> uh -huh. it does that in the battle subway. I don't get why it doesn't do it in verses. Uh -huh. Oh my god. I do think given level disadvantage, though, like, you played well, you picked good moves. You have good team members. Your team members... Um... Like, your team members are really interesting. I like them a lot. Just the stuff that you chose. And you actually warmed me up to Bear Tick a little bit. You were the one who changed my opinion on it a little. Oh, really? <laughs> it was after getting to use it, having it solo Drayden, and also just kind of, for the segments that I played, I used Bear Tick a bit. And I was like, you know, yeah, it's type sucks. Yeah, it's really slow for how sucky its type is. But it doesn't always faint in one hit because its defense is at least good enough. Uh, he, that it... he, he hits pretty hard. And I... like it, it hits back pretty nicely whenever it does survive. I, I mean, I mainly just like picked him because I knew you hated him. <laughs> <laughs> no, I appreciated it. Like the thing is, is that after every let's play, there's always some Pokemon that I was really dismissive of that I realized, you know what? They're not too bad because obviously I can't play using every team member in every situation. So some of it yeah, of is course. just based on, you know, reading up on them. But no, like you were the one who wore me up to bear tick though. So I thank you for your team choices. They were really funny. Some of them. Yeah. I, I mainly just picked ones that like reflected your team. So like, I probably wouldn't have picked a lot of the ones that I did end up picking, but I really just wanted, since this team was working with your with your series, I just wanted it to kind of line up a little bit and reflect some of the things that you were saying along the way. So, hmm. so I'm glad that it worked out the way it did. But you did, you did a wonderful job with that. I'll say that. <laughs> 
Working with it has been a little bit difficult, though, but I'm glad. Mainly, I think I just said choose a starter that's not Oshawott, choose the other fossil that I don't pick, and then I think I had an idea for one of the nicknames, though, but that was, like, all the influence I had on the team. Yeah, everything else was just, like, how can I meme on this series that you're doing? <laughs> What's the most memeable Pokemon that I can pick with what you're saying? Well, there you go. If you thought it was forced memes, then I'm not to blame. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it was absolutely forced memes. Okay. It was all me, though. <laughs> all right. Um. Well, one last thing I'd like you to do is stand in the middle of the Pokeball in the center of the room and look at the clerk in the upper left. I'm scared. Whoa! She looks like she has fangs in addition to no pupils. Whoa, that's spooky. Pixel aliasing, you have been my friend every step of this journey in giving me lots of visual humor I can point out. That's creepy! Well, thank you for joining us. Thank you for all the work that you've done in this series. It's almost to a close, so thank you for coming with us. Oh no, thank you so much for, for letting me help you. It's been, it on, honestly has been a pleasure and I'm glad that I had a part in it. It turned out so well and I'm really proud of you, Emil. Thank you. I'm really proud of you and I think everyone else is proud of you too. You put you put in a lot of work. Thank you. It, it hasn't been easy every step and there've been a lot of delays just because of how much work some of these videos have been. So. Oh no, I, I'm sure. I'm sure, like, just looking at everything that you've done, it's just like, whoa. Uh, at, like, as a video editor myself, it's just like some of the things that you pull off and some of the things that you work on is just super impressive. And I can't even imagine how much time and effort was put into every single video and, like, putting it out as cleanly and as as frequently as you did. It's incredible. And you did, you did a, an amazing job. Keep doing what you do. Thank you. You keep doing what you do, too. I'm very happy with your work as well. <laughs> I try. <laughs> okay. Well, anyway, thank you for joining us. And, uh, yeah, I guess that's it for now. Next time on Pokemon Black and White, we got, shall we say, a big fight ahead of us. See you guys then. Wait, Leah, for the win. Please. Please. Oh, no, stop, okay. <laughs>